right, Sarge, what we got here? We got male, Caucasian, late 20s. Throat cut, bullet on the head, left arm tattoos. Let me see that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think that's what we're going to talk about. <clears throat> What's this here? Damn it. This guy looks familiar. Is he up on the wall at the uh, office there? Um, maybe. You don't recognize him? You don't recognize this guy? Nah. Did uh, somebody step in the uh, I don't know. Dog did shit? you? Oh, shit. Ah, too late. I did. I got a horoscope prediction. Awesome. You're going to have a shitty day. Dirty cops preying on the weak. Hello, Hunter. I did the right Sorry, thing, Hunter. turning him in. Where a twiddle comes to mind. And you're stupid enough to add threatening a superior officer. And admitting guilt. I feel sorry for you guys, but you know what? Fuck it. Last week, I pulled a dead Chinese college girl out of this hotel's water tank. Body was there a whole month. Imagine drinking that water. Made all the papers. <laughs> Did it make a difference? Mm -mm. New batches of unsuspecting tourists still keep coming, and the nameless bastards in the suits and the badges won't shut the place down. You know what? These creeps just made my shit list. You'll never take me in. You bet your ass I will, General. <laughs> you think you did this all by yourself? I promoted you to head of the International Sex Crimes Unit. Me? I used to look up to you. Why did you do it? Why did I do it? What do you think? Was it money? Or was it uh, advancement of science research? Ah, that's what it was. We required millions of people disappearing, never investigated. Nobody cares. You're a traitor. The government's in. Congress sanctioned the Universal Sex Crimes Act. Really? They sanctioned kidnapping, organ harvesting? Really? Hunter, for God's sake, when you were shot, drugs cured you. And those people that tested those drugs, they're dead to save your ass. You know what, General? It's time to move. Stand down, old boy. Diamond, we good? Nobody needs to die here tonight. <laughs> you are not unreachable. Nothing is as it seems. Your lieutenants, the ones you trained, they work for me. Sorry, Hunter. Your dream is not mine. That's just the way it is. We're gonna miss you. Sorry, Hunter. I really liked you. I wish you could have been different. I'll break you as easily as I made you. Do. You guys are gonna do a little jail time. He'll get off with a wrist slap and probably claim some kind of Alzheimer's or some shit. And you, well, you'll get off because you're just following orders. Now you call this meeting, you are out of the military, 
I own the unit now. I don't lose. You brought the case. Yeah. Otherwise, you're a dead man. You, your girlfriend, and you, what, six orphans. I want to shoot you where you are. Breaking news. The Cecil Hotel has been shut down. A surprise health inspection, which uncovered suspicious substances found in food served in the cafe. Several tourists have been hospitalized. More on this story tonight at 11, as well as an exclusive interview with the lead detective on this case, Jody Gonzalez. All right, Jody girl. In another breaking news story, former police officer Howard Wilson has been labeled a cop killer, leaving three dead and two injured in an incident not far from the Cecil Hotel. Our exclusive report Jesus also at 11 o'clock tonight. son of tonight. a bitch. Honey, what's wrong? One of my trainees apparently just went crazy and started killing people. Well, you know what I love about you? Yeah, but tell me again. It's how you stay sane when you see the worst in people every day. So, I'm gonna need you to relax and stop worrying about the orphanage going broke, okay? No. You have a lot of stress in your life. No. Listen, I'll deal with it. You're not going to deal with anything without money. Huh. I'll find a way even if I have to kill somebody. Don't say that. Remember your own words. Your mind hears everything you say. Smart <laughs> ass. <laughs> I'll find a way. Don't you worry oh. about it. I want my fucking money, bitch. You're going to fucking... Give me my damn, give me the damn. I want my fucking, come on. Come on, bitch. I want my fucking money, Come on, suck it, bitch. Come on, give me the fucking case. Give me the fucking money. Come here. Fuck. Ah! Ah! All right, all right. You made your point. Come on, Hunter. This ain't nothing but family business. You know, there's good days and there's bad days. This is a good day for you to die. Huh? I can shoot you in the head, kneecap, stomach, or the balls. Your choice. And guess what? All the neighbors looking out their windows will back me up, saying that you attacked me. You know that. Give it up. Smart choice. Now, get your brother to the hospital. Come on, you dumbass. kids at the orphanage. The state budget's revisions cut our funding. So the kids will be on the streets by week's end. Listen, I will work it out. I'll figure something out for you, you know? Why don't you come over to the house tonight? We'll talk about it. How about uh, night? Cool. All right. See you then. The whole freaking world operates in the thought of hell! Calm down, General. I'm not certain yourself. Don't tell me to calm down! Just sit down. It's off. I'm just trying to think about your injuries. Major. Hunter. How can he be so naive? General Beaumont. If you keep toying with him, he's, he's gonna nail us. Right? He's no dummy. Which means that our FBI authorization to operate a crime ring will crumble and they will hang us out to dry. No, don't, don't say, no, don't, I don't wanna hear about diplomatic immunity because the man, the informant that you killed was his. 
fooling around with Hunter instead of eliminating him? Huh? I just don't fucking get it. I just don't fucking get it. I don't understand, okay? I have made all the money. I've made all the money that I need, okay? I don't need this shit. I can walk away from all of this. I can retire like that, right now. And guess what? That's just what I'm gonna do. You know what? We need Hunter on our side. And your plan B was... You know something? You know what you have to do. So you're an Irish lassie, are ya? Well, you're not in the backwoods of Tennessee no more, Kelly Woods. So you're gonna have to listen to your mum. In this city, if you are being followed, you go to the closest trash bin and start digging through it. If you are being attacked, you yell, I have a disease. I'm on my period or you vomit or piss on the bastard. What? It is stupid, gullible men versus women out there. It looks to me like you've been living on the streets and you do not want to die out there. I had the charges brought down from solicitation. I wasn't hooking. To vagrancy. And I have a man who can help. No. No. No? Listen to me. No. I'm only trying to help you. Do you have any money? Do you have family? Friends? Well, then shut up, listen to me, and do what you're told. Unless you like living in here. Do you? Are you my fair godmother? Yeah. Captain Allison Goodwill. So get your stuff together. And let's go. Why did you let him beat me like that? Girls ain't no good for nothing but birthing sons and cooking. You've known that since you was a little girl. Stop. Mom, you never do nothing. I hate you. It's your emotion talking, honey. You're confused. I don't do nothing. I love you. Daddy loves Stop. you. Don't say that. I hate him. Why do you keep clutching on that stupid statue? Stupid. <sighs> That's your manic depression talking, not you. Girl, we're gonna pray to God now. We're gonna pray for your forgiveness. If God were alive, I'd hate him too. There, I said it. Just like I hate you, and I hate Pa, and I hate Jimmy. No, no you don't, girl. You say it. Only I can save myself. Ain't no statue gonna help me. What are you doing? Stop! Stop! Take these three times a day. What are they for? To keep your strength up. Stop questioning me and trust me. You know, there was a time when women ruled the world. Women only use men for breeding. What are you selling now? I 
I wouldn't expect a high school hillbilly dropout with a crime record to understand matriarchal cultures. Look, I'm sorry if I hurt your feelings, kid. You pulled the dumb card. I don't like it. Can we go now? Are you eat it now! And you don't find your mother! Hey! Who the hell are you? I, I'm not here to rob you. Uh, e easy, dude. E look, you, you can't recommend it to me. Uh, Captain Goodwill? She told you to break in here? Uh, no, no, I... Uh, I didn't think so. I, I got tired of waiting. I, uh, she told me how much you like helping people. Okay, I'm listening. Well, um, I'm from Tennessee. How are you? I've worked so hard and you don't appreciate <laughs> one thing. Um, so I left Tennessee and I, I hitched a ride on Route 66 and ended up here. Jeez. Is that all? Mm hmm Yeah? You sure now? Because your story makes me feel like I want to cut my throat. You want to join me? Thank you. Hey. You there? You want some drugs or something? What's your name? Kelly. Kelly what? What? Age? Mister, don't, please. I, I got nowhere to go. Well, let's see. You can't stay here. I'm sorry. Well, why not? Are all those women going to object to one more? All right, all right, all right. I'll tell you what, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna give you one day. That's it. One day. And out. We have to be very careful about how I get you this money. We cannot tell anyone, not your mom, dad, brother, no one. Right? I understand. Because this is serious and uh, I'll get the money that we need. I know you will, Bubby. Just, <clears throat> I know how you are. How much time do we have? <laughs> a day? I know, a day, two Come on, days. The, the bank knows Pops. I'm a police lieutenant. There's I nobody there we can it. work with? There's, there's, there's... I'm desperate. And I know this is impossible, and I know... Leave it to me. Are you sure? Leave it to me, baby, all right? Trust me. Thank you so much, okay. baby. Give up the case, and I won't hurt you. Whoever you are, my brother will find you. Just give up the case, man, and stop pushing down on the knife. If you get away, I'm dead anyway. What are you doing? Stop pushing on the knife! Oscar will think I set it up. So I'm better dead than on the run. Ah! 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 You crazy son of a bitch! It's just drug money! Just drug money, you crazy. Cop killer update. A bounty on his capture is now one million dollars. The biggest in Los Angeles history. Yeah. I want to pay you back every cent. Yes. I promise, this, Eddie. I gotta go now. Okay. Yes. I gotta this, go take this, care this of this bank. Two hundred and fifty. Bye, man. Yeah, two, more than two hundred. I, I killed someone for you. Here are the minutes. Thanks, Jim.
You don't have a desk. Officer Lee does my desk work. Is that all she does? You want something, Captain? Well, you don't pay me the courtesy of coming to my office, so I have to come to yours. I gave the cop killer case to Sergeant Baran and told him to pass it on to you. And I don't hear from you. You have always been a royal pain in my ass. You know, I don't play the stooge well. Don't they have cases to solve instead of getting into my shit? You trained this cop killer specifically to watch for dirty cops. He's your responsibility. No, ma'am, he transferred from here some time ago. Meeting over. Find him, Hunter. By the way, how's your new house guest? This is my house, and you will respect it. Yeah, yeah, and, and no male visitors while you're not here. What are you, a smart ass? No, something Captain Goodwill told me about you. And I don't want your stuff all over this place, you understand all, me? All right, okay. Or I swear to God, your ass will be out on the street. Okay. Here he comes. What are you guys doing? He's passing through the hotel, and we lost him. Lost him? Off the record, we need to get this bastard. Officer Lee, wow, don't you get enough at home? Piss off, Sarge. Yeah. Don't you ever get fed up with all the crap of daily life? No. How? You're making more than it is. I don't know what's wrong with me. I, I just feel so anxious all the time. Here's the good news. At this very minute, you have the capacity to change your life. Yeah, and? Positive thought. Oh, right. The power of positive thinking. I'm not talking positive thinking. Think positive. You alone have the power. Ah, 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 naughty, naughty. Cigarette's no good. Ah, this is what I think of smoking. Hey. What's up, Sarge? Good <laughs> <laughs> to see you, buddy. What? Who's in there? Hello, Ramsey. <laughs> so maybe I broke your heart a little. But we weren't married that long, sugar. And what do you want? Money. Or I'll go to your captain and tell her what you've been up to. Naughty, naughty. <laughs> don't give me that look. I know you hit Hugo Martin. He's dead, you know. And I don't care about your bimbo at the orphanage or the drug dealers you ripped off. I want to cut. 50 Gs tomorrow. Don't even think about doing anything to me. Or I'll make a copy. See you tomorrow. Damn it! Damn, damn, damn. What aren't you telling me, Kelly girl?
Come on in. Hi, sir. How you doing, girl? Oh, yeah. Good, 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 good. You got something for me? Informer number 4025. We're going to sir. Who you shut the drink? For the record, this is my last job. I'm getting married. Miss you, Jody girl. Congratulations. Well, I've done some good money with you. Customer girl has come up the street and hoping I've done something good in the world. Of course you have. You expecting somebody? No, of course not. So, Mr. Bodyguard, you know about this, too? Yeah, I know about this. That's where he is, because he's trying to hide out among the ignorant engines. Ignorant you know what? I said engines. Ow! Let's touch her again, and I'll kill you. Easy, dude. They got to keep in their place, you know? Here's what I know. Native American women, Alaskan women, are the most abused. They're not dumb, stupid, or lazy. Come on, big you son of a bitch. Congress is holding up a constitutional bill of women's rights because of people like you. You ever hear of constitutional rights? Yeah, and we got ours too late in the 60s. You didn't have to go that far. Give it up. Oscar isn't going to go down easy. Now, this intel is solid. Yeah. His drug soldiers are rolling up on him. They're trying to take over now that Hugo's dead. Yeah, well, they only, we only catch the stupid ones, don't we? Message from the DEA chief. Keep the money. The orphanage is a good cause, but you need to lower the body count. I didn't kill him. He killed himself. You put on a good show, but you got to learn to pull your punches. <laughs> I wasn't trying. Hey, James. What's it feel like to be dead? It's your world, dude. I'm just living in it. Wow. Oh. You are so nice defending my honor. Yeah. So what are you going to do? Who the hell are you? I work for Lieutenant Hunter. <laughs> Why don't you stick around? We can make a hunter sandwich. <laughs> Another time. Get off your ass. Come over here. Hunter sandwich. Look, look. Is that image who you think you are? Is that who you think what you are? What do you want me to say? I don't want you to say anything. I want you to think. I want you to stop living through a prism of an abusive father and a mother who stood by and did nothing. You know, parents influence us, but they don't define us. Get over it. My parents weren't much better. I, I can't stop the voices in my head. Everybody's got two voices. Just make the one you want to win the loudest. Stop yelling at me. I, I, I... Stop the dumb shit. You don't understand what I'm saying. Stop the victimhood. Oh, poor me. You could change your life. Do it, woman. I haven't done anything. It's what other people did to me. Of course it's what other people did to you. It's always what other people do to you. Everybody's killing everybody. Mothers killing babies. School children shooting each other in school. Crazies everywhere, and it's always what somebody did to me, never what you do. Do you understand what I'm telling you? I think that's what they call a meltdown. OK. Look, Kelly, if you could take back the killings you did, if you could do your life differently, what would you do? You can't prove I killed anybody. What about you? I heard you just killed a dirt bag. Little one, you have no idea what I have to do.
glad to find you here. How did you know where I was going to be? This is, this is my sacred spot. This is where I come to get away from it all and regroup. So what do you need? Well, I just thought I'd come to you for some guidance. OK. Um, ha half of your life's experience it will happen just in your mind, you know? But what I have in my mind is from my past, so I, how do I? I guess you have to let the past be the past, don't you? Look at me. If I could do half of the things I know, I wouldn't be in the trouble I'm in. Knowledge is having information. Like, I know all the information on how to control my thoughts and how to control my emotions. I know all that. A lot of people know it. Very few can live it. That's wisdom. Anybody can have knowledge, but a few people have wisdom, which is to know when to use it and to work at it every day. You know, if you get a negative thought in your mind, you have to work tirelessly, 24-7, to eliminate that thought, to answer your question about your past experiences. I got to go bust some bad guys. I'll see you back at the apartment. Good luck. What you are going to do is in your nature. It is natural for you. Do not resist. Do not resist. Put the case down. Listen to me. Your brother killed himself because he was afraid of you. I didn't kill him. We've had uh, reports of sus suspicious activity. Mm -hmm. you seen or heard anything, maybe? So wait, slit his own throat? Is that it? Slit his own throat? Yes, he did. Put hey, the case no. down. End of the day, it's my case. You jet. It's, my money. It's not your money. It's drug money. Just give me the goddamn <laughs> no. OK. Just for a little bit, just 15 minutes, that's all. All right, just 15 minutes, that's all. 15 minutes. Oh. All right. You want to play this out? Then we play it out. Oh, wow, you are pants. Draw your gun, you're a dead man. Relax. Yeah, I'm just, I'm trying to relax. I'm just, you know, I'm a little, little nervous. You sure you won't do this? Just drug money, you damn fool. Since when does get out mean move in? And hold still. What's under that pretty face? There's a lot more if you want to hear it. I thought you said there was no more. Women always say that. You know what? Get out! Oh, oh stop! No! No! no. Don't do that! No. Well, oh, yes, you will. No! You are going. No, just come back. You are going out. Oh, you're hurting me. Get out. Oh. Come here. Oh, you're going out.
tap. First one. Never mind. You can stay tonight. And tomorrow, Sergeant Baran finds you a place. All right. Why don't you get something to patch me up? Killer, as ordered. Stop the bullshit. I want a cut of the money you snatched off that Martin kid. Don't give me that look. 25%. And don't even think about stiffing me. You know there are no secrets around here. Wait. I can't do this. Track a killer and hit a dealer at the same time? Find a way. He's hiding in the mountains somewhere in an Indian reservation. I've got 150 cops searching 400 homes in three states, not to mention the casinos. Go get him. You're authorized for legal force. No warrants required. You want me to take him out? No due process. No trial. The word from up top is he is now considered a domestic terrorist. Nix the Miranda rights. Find a way. Find a way. Kelly. I need my apartment for a couple of days. There's money in the drawer. Go get yourself a hotel room. Later. By the way. Just did. Eyes up, people. You're on watch. I want you to call all the families that he's threatened. Let's bring in this killer protege of mine. Where are you going? To get drunk. Good morning. Is this the home of Officer Jamie Gonzalez? This is Officer Karen Lee. Oh, you remember me. How's your family coping? Don't be worried. We are all deployed in the hunt. Your family is now protected around the clock. Yes, ma'am. But do me a favor and keep me in your prayers by now. We're alternating 12-hour shifts or kids will never be alone. Wow, what a day. First the FBI, and now you from the NSA. So to what do I owe the honor? National Security Agency has the best intel around, and you know that. Who's interagency fighting? You guys better wake up. Everyone protects what's theirs. You know that, too. Now I'm going to give you what they couldn't. You're hunting that uh, cop killer friend of yours, Wilson? Mm -hmm and General Beaumont's friend, Callan, right? Mm -hmm. Hello? Karen, Anderson Cooper is asking for the statement for the department. Yes, at this time, we're asking the public to be supportive of all our men in uniform, no matter what state they're from. But uh, aren't you the guys who let uh, Snowden screw us and then get away? Look, you want the intel or not? I'm going to show you how to catch Wilson and Callan. What's in it for you? <laughs> Food. Breakfast. How civilized. 
Oh, this is really taking a toll out of you. Yeah. So, oh, what the hell? The lion's down. No, huh? no, this is Grand Central Station. Good morning, Karen. Did you spend the night? Please clean up, get back to work. Yeah, you clean up and don't do any work. <laughs> oh, God. I need an office elsewhere. What? What do you want? You know, the other day, we overheard the conversation with your ex. Why am I not surprised? I also noticed your internet history. You use our equipment <laughs> to look at unsavory websites. You sound, like, you sound, like, a, you sound like a police journal or something. What do you want? Look, if you're in trouble, I can help. Well, there's one thing you can do. I'll tell you what's bothering me. I'm worried about this girl that Cam Goodwill dumped on me. Huh? Can you find out something about her? All right. You help me out. You coming in today? Not so loud, man. <sighs> uh, yeah. Give me a couple hours, all right? Don't be late. You look terrible. Why don't you take the rest of the day off and Get rid of some of the stress. Oh, right. You already did that, didn't you? Another cop was killed two nights ago. Detective Miller. You took him to court. Oh, the same one that molested you. Oh, now who's surprised about secrets around here? Look, it can't be Wilson, because he's hiding out in the mountains on some reservation somewhere. The word is Miller threatened you. Courthouse steps. You testified against him. I'm just busting your balls. It looks like a sex crime. Your department. He was killed with a lollipop. Clean yourself up. Again. The city's going to hell. Boys, is that it? Oh, no. What the hell's going on? Arson. Lollipop. Stabbed. The International Sex Crimes Unit. What the hell are we doing here? Huh? Mm -hmm. Now what? Another cop was killed last night, huh? Another one you took to court? Another one you were intimate with. It seems he also threatened you. It was a long time ago. I had your apartment search for arsenic. Oh, charming. Mm -hmm. I didn't find any. You don't happen to have a fetish for lollipops, do you? <laughs> And you have not been doing what you're supposed to do. Hunter has infiltrated our ranks. This cannot stand. Do you understand? Do something about it. 
before it's too late. Now get up there and do it. bedroom uh, you you were having a dream uh, are you okay yeah okay. to go back to your own bed How about you stay over at my place tonight, huh? Why? I'm tired of making your bed. Is that why you don't want to stay at my place because you're going to make the bed? Come on. Come on, baby. My yeah. turn. All right. My place. You going to cook some dinner? <laughs> Here's your dinner. <laughs> Come on. We go home. I'm going to show you how to catch both Wilson and Callan. Yeah. But aren't you the guys? Who let Snowden screw us and get away to Russia? Look, you want the intel or not? Yeah, I'll have it. Thank you. He slips into town by plane train or boat dressed in a hat and a big overcoat he looks like a ghost in in your nature. It is natural for you. Do not resist. Do not resist. Ramsey Hunter is like all men. He is no different. Deep inside, he hates you. He hates women. You must destroy him. Kelly? You must kill him. On the count of five, you will awake and complete your mission. One, two, three, four, five. Awake! Did I, did I 
Vladi. Hi. Hello. I'm Nikki, your next door neighbor. I heard strange noises from inside your apartment. I'm wondering if everything is all right with you. I, yes, I, I, do you know where I can get a, a cheap mattress? Mattress? Sure, I can help you with that. Yes. Just give me a call when you're ready. Hi, Kelly. You mean? I, I did. I, I I watched the Food Network and I uh -huh. read cookbooks. Uh, it smells good. I mean, you know what? I totally forgot. What? I got a dinner date with Bianca. In oh. fact, I'm late. I better get out of here. I'm real. I'm sorry about that. And just throw it out, okay? Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I, oh. Nobody has to know. Oh, I wouldn't tell anybody anyway. But I just want to make sure you're okay. Mm hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. What are you up to now, girl? What do you say? My roommate. She's not at home right now. Hi. It must be Kelly. Well, hello there. Hey, baby, what are you doing here? I really shouldn't be doing this. Just relax. You know, just have some of this and relax. Sergeant, bring me that report. Police department. No, Los Angeles police. Here now, Travel Lodge, Chatsford, Detective Santo, civilian officer down. 
double homicide. Hmm, looks like you're taking over my spot. Well, I'm just trying to do what you told me to do. Well, that's good, but this is my sacred place. You knew that, right? <laughs> yes. All right, so how's it going? I'm working on it. Is it working? You calming down? You, you um, like... I feel a little bit calmer. I'm glad you're working on it. If I could get the rest of the world to work on it, including myself, the world would be a better place, wouldn't it? I guess. What the mind can conceive, the mind can achieve. Never forget that. I'll try to remember that. Only see what you want, not what you don't want. Because whatever you see is what you get. I'll see you back at the house. So that's it, huh? What happened to us? I, I used you to help the orphans. Excuse me? I can't, I, I never loved you. Okay, you can hit me. Go on, just, just hit me right here on my face. I know I'm a terrible person. I know this girl. What? When I worked in Tennessee, we had outstanding warrant on her. This is the girl Captain sent you? Yeah. Why didn't you tell me? You're Kelly? She disappeared again, and I put an APB on her. Good. You gonna tell me about your little Kelly girl back in Tennessee where they came from. Be way up on some God-forsaken mountain back in the way. Need to talk to you. It's all just need to talk to you. Oh, there you are. Four cups. Well, of course you can have something to drink. How does it taste? Is it good? You eat up. You eat up every little bite right there. For you too. The hell is she doing? Mama Woods, I need you to come over here. Come on, come on. Put the gun down. Not one move. All right, I see you. I see you right there. Come on, come on, come on over here. All right. I'm Lieutenant Ramsey Hunt. Okay. I can. See, from that rusted ass gun you got there, you probably ain't got no bullets. Maybe I reloaded walking up to you. Besides, ain't you gonna say to me, go ahead and make my day? No, I'm supposed to tell you, put that gun down, or I'll blow your damn head off. Come on, give it to me. Look, I know what it's like to be from a different place, yeah? Tennessee ain't like Los Angeles. It's okay. I'm here to help you now. I just want to talk to you, all right? Hey. Now, I'm here looking for your daughter. Have you seen her? Now, your daughter been staying with me for a while, but she's gone. I don't know where she went to, and I thought maybe she's here. Is she here? No, I... My dinner is burning. Okay. All right, Mama Woods. Here's only one thing I want to ask you, and I'll leave you alone, okay? 
If you to your fantasy world, why didn't Kelly kill you? I'm a mama. You can't kill your mama. Besides, she ain't killed nobody. It's all in her mind. <sighs> Talk to me, Officer Lee. It's on you now, boss. From your GPS, I can see Wilson is holed up in a warehouse with two hostages 10 miles from you. OK. Here's what I want you to do. No backup. I want radio silence. Let me get there first. Do we have an ID on the hostages at all? Don't know. Don't go out there alone, boss. It's a setup. Wilson called me with the address. He's waiting. What do you want me to do? He called you with the address. Ramsey Hunter. Sight for sore eyes. Yeah. Yeah, these bitches. They ain't the issue, man. I needed your attention. I'm here. Yeah. You and I don't see eye to eye. One of them dies. Then you shoot me and I die. <laughs> Who will you choose? Who will you save? Come on, Howard. Yeah, which one? Come on. Choose! Choose! Come on, Howard. Choose! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, this one right here. She hates you just a little bit more. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> man, you know how it is. You know how it is on the force, man. And you, a black man, didn't even stand with me, dog. Howard. This is between you and I. Well, but let them go. What is this? I handcuffed a suspect. Huh? My superior kicked him to death. And I couldn't take it anymore. Hey, you, you wanna know, you wanna know what happened? That cop made captain. Even promoted his daughter. Her father did that. All right. Howard, I got it. You're an injustice collector. Yeah. All right, but Howard, Captain's daughter, what has she done? These other people you're running around killing, what have they done? Howard, this makes no sense. How are you going to make your point if you're dead? You know this, man. These white cops, they joined the force just to intimidate and, 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 and screw over the, the uneducated and the uninformed man and the poor. You know this. You know this, man. Not all white cops. Yeah, all. Howard, they sent me here to kill you. Now, I'm not gonna do that. They hate us. Hmm? They hate us. Why do we even try? Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Don't even think. You no, gotta stop this. No, I'm not gonna stop it. You know what? I just heard them. I heard them the other day talking about they're gonna kill you. Kill you. Yeah. Believe that. Killing you. So let me do you this solid, man. I'll go ahead and knock them both out right now. You know, that's what I'm gonna do. Take them out. Howard! What was he talking about? Thank God. Killing me. What was he talking about? Thank God, he's delusional, he was stone crazy. Captain? There is something. What? There is something what? It happens, yes. So what's You're the next stop in this investigation? Well, I'm going to take a vacation. I don't know about the captain. There's always another bad guy. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, it looks like you're back in the no Everybody, stop! Listen! So on the run Important suspect, breaking Kelly news. Woods come on. Was a woman who hitchhiked a ride with him come on, come on. Come on, come in. With information. It's still out there. What's going on? There's still a killer out there. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my I picked her up along Route 527 a few months ago. Her face was all messed up and covered in blood.
Maybe. I react to threats violently. A little stab in here, a little arsenic there. You got something to prove, Mr. Hunter. No, you're not. What you're doing is reacting to a traumatic experience over and over and over in your mind with no emotional control, just like millions of humans. My pa hated me. Now I hate you. No. You see, that's an illusion. You don't hate me. Oh! Oh! Hey! Oh! Oh! Orphan babies. No. I was an abused orphan, Kelly. I came from there. She's lying to you. Don't you think I know what it feels like to have the whole world against you and to make you feel like your brain's gonna explode? Like an alien or something? Yeah. Yeah. Just like that. Aliens? Nice one, Ramsey. You want the rest of the money. You know the 15 mil in drug money you forgot to mention? You thought your little rip-off trips out of town would stay a secret? We are so close. We even share the same intral cycle. Give us the cash and we'll let you live. Why? Why did you bring the kid into this? I worked in Tennessee once. I was the first to bust Kelly as a runaway. I couldn't believe my luck when this little junior killer showed up on my doorstep. It was simple. First, I played the game one at a time. They decided to change the game plan and ganged up on me. <laughs> Kelly, listen, I'm going out of town for a couple of days, and what I need you to do is look after the apartment, okay? Can you do that? Sure, but another robbery? Stop talking crazy. Here, that's for whatever you need. Okay. In another matter, Ramsey has always had women problems. Maybe because his mother left him at the orphanage doorstep. Since then, he's always felt abused, abandoned, unloved, abused, unloved. Every woman he screwed was the mommy he never had. That's why he handcuffs them during sex, so he won't get away and leave the baby. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's cut this psycho babble bullshit. I'm not afraid to die. You're going to take my 15 mil, and you're going to kill me anyway, right? All right. I've got a $3,000 bottle of champagne there. How about a last toast? No. Yes, get the money first. All right. All right, money. See that? Caution, caution. 24-7, direct link to my attorney. One push of the button, what you just did. Cops will be here any minute. Did you forget I was married to you? Don't you think I disarmed everything? You know what? Shoot him. No, no, okay. Shoot him, I'll find him. Yeah, sure you are. Well, let me get you the money first. You can stop this nightmare right now. I, I killed two men right no, here. No, 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 you haven't. You haven't. It's all an illusion. It's all on your mind. You can change your life right now. You can wake up. I want you to wake up. You can change your life. You can change your behavior. I've done it. I've done it. You can do it. Wake up, girl. Wake up. Wake up. 
Trust me, man. Trust us, Kelly. Wake up. Look at him, Kelly. He's crazy. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. No, no, wake up. Look at him. Shoot him. Shoot him. No, wake up. Wake up. Please. Please. Kill them. Kill the abusers. No, no, wake up. Wake up. Please. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Welcome back. She's awake, everyone. She's awake. Hey, kid. How you doing? Is this you awake? What the hell made you hit yourself in the head with the statue last night? Were you and Mom playing a game? Yeah, just a game. Oh, baby, I'm so glad you woke up. Mom? It's a good thing Dr. Goodwill was on call. Oh, no, 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 don't, don't try to get up just yet. I was so concerned about my little girl. Dad? We sent Baran to try to find you. The name is not Baran, it is Baran. How many times do I have to correct you off? Kelly, he gave you a silly nasty bomb. I was gonna cancel, but I traveled 500 miles to celebrate your birthday picnic. You know your teacher and your mentor wouldn't let you down. Kelly? Your doubts and fears become reality, unless you decide otherwise. Love yourself. There's something above and beyond, and I can never, ever get things right in my life. Yes. Dreams are meant to instruct. They transport us to new dimensions, show us symbols to be interpreted to enhance our existence. Some dreams are horror movies or fantasy, some heartbreaking. We are not meant to be confined within our thought and feelings. I will share secret one of the universe. When you dream, stop moving and look down at your feet. Look at your clothes and note their colors. Now look up. What is your location? Where are you? Search your dreams. You're born, live, die. What is it all about? Powerful secrets await you.
Such a dick, cause I've lost my love, my falling globe. 